Assalamu alaikum everyone. All praises and uh, salutation towards Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam. Today's our topic is climate change. So let's know about what is climate change. Climate change means the change of temperature uh, that is caused for global effect. How it is. Um, it is affected by greenhouse gases, especially carbon dioxide is the most. So, what is the impact of this climate change? There are several impacts of climate changes. Our sea levels are rising, and uh, not only this, and uh, for this reason, there is one person of if there is a um, one person of increasing sea level that could make uh, um, 25 to 30 million people's life approach from their home and uh, it case it is frustrating that Day by day, it is increasingly, and this is the time to stop by making cautious, by making uh, this sort of thing, so that we could make a change. And there are several things that are um, working together. There is COP twenty five. Or if we call about confirmation of the parties and uh, Ramsar conversation, and uh, there are many sort of programs are taken. There is also a global funding. But the most interesting fact is that those countries who are committed, are who are um, share a large portion of these uh, issues or this problem especially china and us there are some out of this uh, sort of agreement so the initiative died is a uh, just in a one fact or one moment so what can we do what is our duty? We can introduce some new things. Uh, what are they? They might be, uh, we can use uh, some plantation program. This may be fruitful for some cases, but we have to check our main issue. That is uh, the reduction of pollution. How to do that? If you are using a um, global network, then you see that, or if you are in visiting a country like Bangladesh or South Asia, you saw that there are people who are um, denying the fact that they are harming the environment. Why I'm saying denying the fact? Because they indiscriminately put polythin and other words in indiscriminately without any conscience. And some industries doesn't follow the proper uh, guideline and uh, proper program as well. So what would be the outcome? Then in this way, we could uh, not uh, make it out so that's all for today's and we'll be catch up on the next session thank you very much